Welcome back to Lowell, Massachusetts in the Sanga Center. Game two between Minnesota and Boston in the PWHL Finals set to get underway. It is the calm before the storm. To Can Boston take the commanding 2-0 series lead or will Minnesota rise to the occasion and tie this series up before heading home for game three? Looking to protect this puck, Channel will push her off the puck. Kava now it's one-on-one unfolding for Minnesota. Kava has points Schofield with her. She'll offer a pass and she scores! It gets redirected and Minnesota has opened the scoring. Close. You can see that she's one on two, a little fake, and she shuts the door. She seals the wall. And now Kaba through that neutral ice. Look at her having a little bit of a look see. And Ken Clay talked about her IQ, a little bit of a fake. And you can see Megan Keller trying to take away that pass back door. But Kaba, little pause, little pause. And it winds up going off of the stick of Megan Keller redirects. And Kaba looking to make that play to Kendall Coyne. Schofield thinking that she can feather it in. And it's an unfortunate bounce. Deidre Alamo is still able to get a shot on net. Jade's jumping right back to her feet to keep this puck in the zone. Now looking for an opportunity, and she scores! Sophie Jake strikes, and it's 2-0 Minnesota. It's on that last game, but it's all about the exit. You heard Clan Klee talk about quick close support. That's exactly what happens. Three, four-foot passes. Now all of a sudden you're in the offensive zone. That first shot comes, you got to recover that puck. Low to high on the ice. Makes a deceptive move to gain the dot and then puts it nice and low because she recognizes she's got Booter on it as well as kind of net front, but that's just a beautiful play. As you can see that she pushes it back to the outside to be able to get that shooting angle. I mean, she was down and she was able to pick that puck up. Bates trying to feed it to the far side, gets awkward bounce and rolls right into her skate. Now she'll try for the empty cage and she'll get it. Sophie Jakes, two goals here tonight. But Minnesota takes a three nothing lead in back-to-back -back games in the finals. Jake's getting not one, but two <laughs> playoff goals in her inaugural final run. And so Minnesota, a three-nothing win against Boston, has evened the series up as they head home for game three.